Welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to set up a microphone on a Windows 11 PC or laptop. You should be able to follow this video to set up any type of microphone, whether it's connected via USB, a 3.5mm connector, or part of a headset. The video should also help fix minor issues with your microphone, for example, if it is not selected. Check my channel if you have any other problems, or if it isn't working, as I'll have videos that help fix a microphone that isn't working in Windows. Remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe if the video helps. Let's get into the method. To set up a microphone in Windows 11, the first thing we need to do is connect it. It is important that you choose the correct port on your PC to plug it into. Make sure it is the microphone port and not the headphone port, and that the ports are compatible, such as with USB 2 and 3, although this shouldn't be a problem. Now that we have it connected, we have to ensure that it is selected and set up in Windows 11. We'll begin by making sure it is selected as the default sound input device. To do this, go to the main settings page. You can get there a number of ways, but we'll be searching for it in the search bar. In the settings, go to the system settings from the options on the left, although you should be already in there by default. In the system settings, click on the option called sound. Within the sound settings, scroll down until you are in the section called input. Under here, it should say something like, choose a device for speaking and recording. Below this, you should see the list of microphones connected to your PC. If you have multiple, select the one you want to use by checking the box to the left of its name. If you don't see your device here, scroll down and click on all sound devices. Now find your device from the input section, click on it, and then choose allow on the next page. It should now appear back in the input section of the main sound settings page. From here, you can also quickly adjust the volume of the microphone with the slider. Click once on your microphone to customize some of these settings. First, you might be able to rename the microphone to something that helps you differentiate it from the others. Click rename under its current name to do this. Also within here, you can change some more settings, such as the quality format and the input volume for just this microphone too. You can test your microphone to see if it is working properly, and there could be other options in here in the future, or depending on the exact microphone and its connection type. You can search for the latest drivers at the top of the page, which is quite helpful too. Those are most of the ways to set up a microphone. If for some reason something didn't quite work out, we can use the more traditional way to set up the microphone. This might have extra features as well, such as a mic boost, but most of the options will be the same as in the main settings page, so you don't necessarily need to follow this. To do this, first go to the control panel. You can get there by searching for it in the search bar. In the control panel, click on hardware and sound. Now click on sound and it should open a separate window. In the new window, first go to the recording tab. You should see all of the microphones in here. If you don't see it, right click on an option and choose show disabled and show disconnected devices. To enable your mic in here, right click on it and then click on enable. You can set it as the default microphone in here too with the button. To customize the mic settings from here, double click on your microphone or right click on it and then go to properties. In the properties window, you can try and update any drivers by going to properties again, this time for the controller, then to the driver tab, and then click on update drivers if you can. Back in the main properties window, each tab will have a few options to choose. The levels tab will allow you to change the input volume and you might be able to adjust the mic boost in here too. In the advanced tab, you might have more ways to customize the microphone, such as the quality format. You can close this window once you are happy with the settings. And so that is how to set up a microphone on a Windows 11 PC or laptop. Click the card on screen now to watch a video of mine showing you 10 easy ways you can speed up your Windows PC. Those methods should work on nearly all versions of Windows. Help support the channel by visiting the store. The link is in the description and at the end of the video. If you have any questions, then let me know in the comments below. And if you did find today's video helpful, remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe for more tips in the future. Be sure to stick around to see some of my other videos that you might be interested in. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in another video.